for buffer 1 at this time we are using thin pH so buffer 1 is thin pH then buffer 2 we are using 7 uh, pH so it's already emerged in the buffer 10 okay so then set the two buffers we have set the buffer 1 and buffer 2 then we'll go for calibration sensor call then we'll perform a uh, two point calibration in auto. We could also perform manual, I mean one point and manual grab or manual. So at this time we will perform two point in auto. So confirm this one, then it will start the process. So uh, the analyzer is asking to immerse the, the sensor in buffer one. So our buffer one is thin. So Enter. Now it started. Now buffer one has done, so it is it's asking to immerse buffer two. And uh, now we will get the buffer two. But first we have to clean. We will clean the sensor. All right. So this is buffer. 7 pH yeah. first we'll clean it with water we'll clean it with water so the reading now is 6.98 it is stable so we can proceed now for the buffer to process Alright. Okay. Calibration fail. Calibration fail. This instance of calibration fail. Just immerse the sensor onto the buffer for quite some time and repeat the process. Otherwise, replace the sensor. So our calibration process has over. So we'll check the calibration result. Now the slope is 84.6% at 6.97 pH. So that's it and we'll go back to the monitoring display. Okay, so that is the registered pH measured. So this is thin. All right. 